there is no reason why driver, if you were if you were driving a reefer or a flatbed, that you should be deadheading that much. That means you as a dispatcher did something wrong. I'm telling you, and I stand by that. Now, if a hot shot box truck, that's something different. I don't know about that. But if it's a drive-in, power only, um, maybe not power only, because sometimes you got a deadhead to like, you know, get, go pick up a, a loaded trailer. I mean, um, a loaded trailer or a, a loadout trailer. Not be deadheading, deadheading over 150 miles max. I honestly try to keep it under 100 miles, and that's too much, because every 50 miles is an hour to a driver. Let me say that again. Every 50 miles is an hour to a driver. So if they deadheading 150 miles, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's three hours. That's three hours pretty much that they don't waste their day or three hours off the clock. Every 50 miles is pretty much like an hour to a driver. And then you might have to tack on some more if it's traffic, depending on what type of time of day it is. So deadhead is something that drivers don't want to do. Try your best to keep it under 150, 150 max. Um, and if it's 150 miles, that next load better be paying good. If you want to see the rest of this video, head on over to my YouTube page where I share more information for new dispatchers. Also, if you need additional help, check out my mentorship program in the link in my bio. And if you need your trucks moved out here in this horrible market, also head on over to my website where I can get you right out here. Take care.